Welcome to more Pokemon Emerald. We're back with the 2019 Randomizer Nuzlocke, or Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke, why not? So we're still here in the gym. We somehow managed to win. We gotta go try and get a second gym badge today, but this time I'm gonna try to keep it a little bit, a little bit shorter. Last time I kind of ended up going for three and a half hours. I'm gonna be more strict with the two hours this time, but maybe we can get a badge in time. And suddenly, suddenly buttheads. Oh, this is the guy who gave us his great ball. Don't take my, my goods! Uh-oh. Well, we could help him, or we could go to the Pokemon Center. So let's go do that. <laughs> I'm Psycho, and this is Disney Channel. Oh, man. Okay, guys, so um, I wrote some Pokemon lore for my team. I want you guys to, to hear this. This is the story of our pirate crew. Okay, so first off, well, let, me, let me go to the Pokedex entries here. Uh, hold on, let me put them in order. I wrote them in a certain order. Let's go switch. Let's put you up front because he's the captain. We'll put you here. Okay, we'll put you here. Uh, okay, so let's start from here. So first off, we have Whiskey Jack. He's the captain of the ship. The only problem is he's always drunk drinking Jack Daniels and he's always just loafing around. So he's kind of an incompetent captain, but he tries. And he's got a goofy face too. Oh, wrong way. Down here we have Windows XP. This is meant to be the ship's navigation system, but they're always crashing, getting that blue screen of death, so they're constantly getting lost at sea. Here we have Mrs. Donut Boy. They're the they're the chef. They're the chef of the uh, of the ship here, and they only know how to make donuts. So everyone is constantly eating donuts, and they're completely sick of it, but uh, they just keep making more donuts. Here we have Egg Balls. Egg Balls is the cast form, so they're supposed to change form to give people a heads up of what weather is coming. So if a storm's coming, it's going to ruin the ship. They should they should know about it, but no one ever pays attention to that. Instead, they just always want to eat Egg Balls because they're so sick of Mrs. Donut Boy's donuts that they're desperate to eat anything else, so they want to eat Egg Balls. And kind of a similar situation with Pichalupa. They're a gosh dang Chalupa. Everyone wants to eat them. Now they have the lightning rod ability, so they're constantly causing the ship to get struck by lightning. It's pretty terrible. Everyone wants to throw them overboard to get rid of the lightning rod, but they're a baby, so no one can bring themselves to do it. And then we have Venustoice, dude. Venustoice is the only competent one on the team. He's the only one who's got his crud together, but everyone else is crazy and never listens to them, so they just always sit off in the distance and just judge everyone from afar. That's that's our team right there. That's our pirate crew. There you go. Top 10 anime characters, but we only have six characters. Did I already heal? Yes, we're good. Bread, eggs, donuts, and a chalupa. I guess everyone's kind of food, aren't they? Except for Venus Toys and Windows XP, but I mean, I guess you could eat an operating system. Aya, you fell overboard. Yeah. That's true. Okay, guys, we're gonna go and see if we can save Pico. The cave is over this way. I think Pico's gonna be inside. Oh, gosh dang it, dude. I don't want to talk to you with your weird backwards hair. Oh, jeez. Oh, it's you. <laughs> hey, look at this, guys. He called me fantastic. This guy knows what's up. Maybe this guy's not so bad after all. Okay, we'll go help you get your goods back. Okay, who do we want to have up front to actually kill stuff? Oh, uh, how about Egg Balls? I should probably level up Venus Toys, because Venus Toys is going to evolve pretty soon. Ooh, first trainer of the day, my Pokemon rule. Uh, trying to think of a, a witty quip for that. Here we have Scribe Donna with one Pokemon. Wow, <laughs> his Pokemon rules, guys. <laughs> He's breathtaking. Let's go for bite, I guess, just to try to flinch him here. Oh my gosh. Oh, he's got rough skin. My egg balls. Why does everything have fighting attacks? Thankfully, not a lot of damage from this guy. We're fine. Okay, so Cascoon is dead. Are we going to get level 13? Oh, we definitely are. So egg balls is getting pretty close to evolving. Okay, let's go ahead and put Venus Toys up front. I kind of want to level them up first just because they're the closest to evolving. Well, unless Pichalupa evolves easy in this, but I, I don't know if they do. Wait, Casper evolves? Uh, actually, I don't think they do. Dude, Mr. Mime, we can't catch it though. We already caught Pichalupa on this route. Uh, you know what? We're going to run. We'll just go fight trainers here. Okay, we're going to go beat up this lady. I study at school. What kind of person would study at a school? That's not what schools are for. 
Operator Cami. Dude, there's been a couple camis throughout this playthrough. Of course, I send out <laughs> I send out a Bulbasaur. Instantly, it's a fire type. So let's go over to... Uh, actually, Mrs. Donut Boy has the water attack here. Schools are for sleeping. There you go. Yeah, it's nap time. Ow. Okay, they did the munching crunch on me, but I'm going to go for Hydro Pump. Yeah. So I was looking at the uh, the next gym leader, guys. The gym leader only has two Pokemon. One is level 17 and one is level 18. So I think that we're going to have no problem with this gym. I mean, our Pokemon are already probably strong enough to t uh, deal with that gym. I'm in shock. Dude, those are the best times. Nap time. What the crud? I haven't beat this guy up yet. Uh, isn't it three in Emerald? Oh, right. I must have been looking at Ruby and Sapphire. Okay, this guy's got Electabuzz. But yeah, dude, the best times. Snack time. Nap time. Um, pizza time. Let's go for... Oh yeah, Venus always has uh, Bone Meringue. Let's just do that. Crud! <laughs> I don't want to go back to my Pokemon menu. Let's go fight. Do some bone meringue. Do I even have to use both hits? Okay, just just barely. Look at that little bit of HP. Electabuzz's pose is kind of weird. What the crud is Electabuzz? Is he a cat? We got level 14. I forget, guys. Does Bulbivore evolve at 16 or does he evolve at uh, 18? Okay, hey, Bone Meringue on Steelix as well. Just all the good Bone Meringue targets. Well, I guess his defense is too high. Holy crud, Bethany with the five gifted subs. Thank you so much. Holy crud. Gosh dang. So he evolves at 16. So just two more levels and we're good to go. Kind of taking a little snap right now. Snap? <laughs> taking a little nap. I guess that's snap time, dude. It's, uh... Merging nap time and snack time. That's what Pokemon Snap was all about. Steelix stole Jiggly's stage. Can I just wake up, please? Thank you. Holy crud. Okay, so we get Steelix killed. 336 experience? What? Dude, that is more experience than we got from that Moltres in the last episode. I mean, to be fair to Moltres, they were only level 6 and Steelix was level 8, but still. Pokemon Snap. Oh my gosh, dude. There needs to be a Pokemon Snap and uh, Thanos crossover for sure. Okay, so we're going to go back and heal. We'll work our way towards this cave, but one step at a time, guys. It's like that uh, Christmas cartoon with the, the Yeti guy. Or He wasn't a Yeti, he was like a wizard. Last time I completed the Pokedex in Let's Go. Oh heck yeah, man! Dude, Let's Go is like one of the only Pokedexes that that's actually reasonable to complete. A lot of them are really tough. Well, unless you just have someone trade you the stuff, but if you want to get it yourself, it's pretty tough. <laughs> Pokemon Snap 3. Aw, oh, Snap. Oh, okay, we're gonna do a double battle. I'm feeling it, guys. Venus Toys. You know what, dude? Whiskey Jack is kind of falling behind. So we're going to have Venus Toys and Whiskey Jack take these two on. If the tunnel doesn't go through, then I'll just go over the top. Okay. So we've got a doctor and a scribe. Three Pokemon, but one guy only has... <laughs> what the crud? Why is there all these bugs? I think he's going to go down no problem. So we'll do Bone Ring on the Beautifly. And then we'll do a uh, body slam, I guess. You know what? We'll just have them both hit Beautifly. Wait! Oh, please do not tell me Icy Wind hits my hits my Bulbasaur. Please, no. Don't hit Venusaur. Or Venus Toys. Oh, I'm so nervous. Don't hit him. Don't hit him. Okay, we're good. I th I'm an idiot. What did I think... Oh my gosh, dude. Why did I think Beautifly was Poison Bug? Why do I always mix up my gosh dang winged bug Pokemon? Gosh dang it. Okay, Beautifly is Bug Flying 
Butterfree is bug flying, but Beedrill, Beedrill is bug poison, Venomoth is bug poison. Gosh dang it. <laughs> Fake Pokemon fan. I don't know why, just lately I've always been messing up. Oh my gosh, dude. Well, we got Mrs. Donut Girl here, or Mr. Donut Girl, and uh, we're gonna beat them up with the Bone Meringue. This is not the real Mr. Donut Girl, this is a phony. Let's go for Icy Wind here. There we go. Guys, so we have Mr. and Mrs. Donut Girl and Miss uh, and Boy. If they had a baby Pokemon, what would the baby be named? Ooh, level 15, dude. One more level we can get we can uh, digivolve. Sky uppercut. Yes. An uppercut thrown as if leaping into the sky. I think I might get that in place of Hyper Beam, honestly. Hyper Beam is so risky because it's two turns. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> That'd be a donut hole, that's so good. What? What? They want to learn Rock of Throw as well? Throw small rocks to strike the foe. Just like, throw some gravel at them. I, mean, I guess that's what Graveler does. I mean, I love Rock of Throw, but... I don't know if we want that, our moveset is so good. So I'm gonna skip out on that, I'm so sorry guys. Okay, we got Whiskey Jack up to level 13 as well. Get that boomerang. Come on, what is it with me and missing? Sludge Bomb is coming in. That should not do very much. Not on Whiskash. Okay, we'll be fine. Let's go for boomerang again. Uh, this time we'll go for... I guess we'll go for Body Slam. I almost did Extra Sensory, and then I would have been an idiot once again because it probably would have been immune to it, right? Okay, got the boomerang. Body Slam. I could go for Petal Dance. I think that would have probably done a little bit more. Maybe? I don't know if Bulbasaur is better at physical or special attacks, but what I do know is Petal Dance is scary because it can confuse us, then we can kill ourselves. Okay, so we got that one done. We actually did not take that much damage at, uh, while doing that. Oh, Sky Uppercut, which we just learned. I could use that, yeah. Okay, let's go beat up this guy now. I have a fighting move now, dude. I pay attention. Bring it on, Dr. Wayne. Oh, guys, do not bring the memes into the chat here. Uh, well, you can meme, I don't mind. Uh, let's go to... I guess we'll go back to Mrs. Donut Boy, because they do have the water attack. <laughs> the memes are coming, oh no! Oh, Sky Uppercut can use to be, uh, to hit flying stuff, that's cool, okay. Hydro Pool? I missed! Dude, why couldn't Lapras miss in the last episode? Leech life. That's actually going to hurt pretty bad. Wow, five damage. I'm going to die. Dude, goopy balls. Here we go. Get him destroyed. Dude, it's kind of crazy because I leveled up my team so much that these trainers are actually pretty easy. I feel like I should have grinded by fighting these trainers rather than grinding on wild Pokemon, but oh well. We're going to go over to Egg Balls, do some bite here. What is the definition of Wahe? Um, I have no idea. It's just the thing that the uh, polar bear dude from uh, Banjo Kazooie says. His name's Boggy. I uh, just got here. Did I miss the thing? No, no, nothing important, man. Yo, Demo, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub, dude. How long have I been streaming? Uh, 20 minutes? Not very long. Yeah. It's getting going. Mm -hmm. Wahey is the definition of Wahey. You know, everyone in chat, or if you're watching this on YouTube, guys, in the comments, can you please provide a definition of the word yo? We got... Whoa. Oh my gosh, dude! Is that the best item in the entire game that we just found? What the crud? Here we go, dude! We got an apple core! Um, we're gonna go and give this to someone. Guys, who do we give the apple core to? That's insane. <laughs> Leftovers is the definition of yo. That is so good. Yeah, we could probably give it to Venus Toys. Venus Toys is like the only competent one on the team. 
No, Mrs. Donut Boy is pretty good too. Someone tanky, preferably? Yeah, I mean, we could give it to Whiskash. Guys, if they're loafing around, do they still get to heal from the, uh, from the leftovers? Because if they can still heal while we're loafing around, that's probably pretty good. They will still get to heal? Oh, that's so good then. We'll give it to Whiskash there. Okay. Right here, guys, there's a small Indian in the wall. Uh, I don't know what we can do with that. Well, nothing right now. Let's go talk to this old guy. Oh, what am I to do? Oh no, not Pico! My darling Pico! <laughs> Roar! Oh my gosh, dude, my cat is laying on top of my computer. I don't want her to reach over and hit the power button. If the stream dies, you know why. Okay, we're gonna go inside the cave. The spooky cave. Oh my gosh. I'm not gonna- Oh, jeez! I'm not gonna make any jokes about what all this smoke is. I am just gonna go grab this ball. Right over here we've got Thunderstone. Wait a second. Oh my gosh. Wait, never mind. I got really excited because if we got Pichalupa to a Pikachu, we could use that. But evolutions are randomized, so they're not going to become a Pikachu. Gosh dang it. Who do I have up front? Still being a stoice. They're not full HP. Maybe a little bit risky, but we're going to go for it. Keel Hall. Uh, can't you use it on Pichu? I think Pichu evolves by friendship. I mean, I'm gonna go check and see if any of my Pokemon are compatible with Thunderstone. Marsh Stomp. Oh my gosh, do we have any grass attacks? We do, we have Petal Dance. Yes, man! Oh, hit him with that, Crod. Hit him with the flowers. Death by good smells. There we go, got him. Oh, dude, this might be level 16. What?! Okay, we got Flame Body. I guess they're just too hot. There it is, man. We're gonna have our first evolution. Who the crud is Venus always gonna turn into? Artist Jonathan going down. Whoa, my career! Here it is, man. What do we got? Oh, man. Just show me! Is that Nidorina? Oh, no. Are we gonna have to find a Moonstone now? Gosh dang it. I mean, that's not that bad, but... Uh, <laughs> okay, <laughs> we have Nidorina. Just gotta find a Moonstone now. Don't mind me. Well, I was kind of hoping for a Legendary, maybe like a Zapdos or something, but... Oh, well. I mean, there's still a Poison type. That's kind of cool. Alright, we've got the goods. We go into the Smoky Cave and we get the goods. Too much crime going on in here. Pico owes her life to you. That's kind of dark. I sincerely thank you. Is Nidorina a boy or a girl? Uh, I don't know. Let's go check. Oh gosh, how do you find out? I mean, I know we can just look at our Pokedex to find out they're a girl, okay. But I mean, in the actual world of Pokemon, how the crud do they figure that out? I don't want to think about this anymore. Let's just go back. And we're gonna go, I don't think we can get through that cave without Rock Smash. Now, I think if we get cut, we can go through here, but we don't have that quite yet. So, we can't fight those trainers. I forget where we get cut. Actually, shouldn't we have cut right now? Don't we have to go to the, the Devon building, return the goods and get cut? Wait, catch a Pokemon? Can we catch something in the cave? Okay, let's go back and get something in the cave, yeah. Okay. How the crud did we go through that entire cave without finding a single encounter? We're gonna put egg balls up front, and let's go see what we got, guys. Oh, there's a cut house in Rustboro. Gotcha. Oh, the Devon Goods gives you, like, the Poke Gear or the Poke Nap, whatever it is, right? Okay, we got Grand Bull. That's actually a really good physical attacker. Okay, let's go for... Oh, gosh. Can we actually hurt this guy without killing him? Okay, maybe Giga Drain, right? Giga Drain is super weak. There's no way he'll survive one Giga Drain. It's only 60 power in this game. And it's just coming from a cast form. Yeah, there we go. All right, guys. Sky Uppercut! Why does everything have fighting attacks? Please. Okay, that doesn't do that much. He's only level six. Let's go Pokemon. I'm gonna switch to someone else. Let's go to Mrs. Donut Boy here. And then we're gonna start chucking some balls, dude. I'm definitely not going to use, <laughs> I'm not gonna use my recycle. What the heck? Not gonna use my Master Ball on this. Let's just stick to some Pokeballs. 
Yeah, just Pokeballs. I've only got four. I need to go buy some more here. Here we go, guys. Holding down B. Let's catch ourselves a... Crud. Recycle. He's trying to recycle himself. He's calling himself garbage, dude. Okay, here we go. Does this mean if we catch them, they're going to be the janitor? They're going to be like the cleanup crew on the ship? Oh, yes, we got them. Okay, guys. So Granville trying to recycle everything. They are the cleanup crew for the ship. Fairy Pokemon. Wait. Fairy Pokemon? Do they actually get fairy type once you get to the Gen 6? <laughs> name it Grandma. Uh, okay. If you guys want me to name it Grandma, I can do that. It's a, a dude, but you know what? That's fine. <laughs> Do you guys Are you guys cool with Grandma? Oh, Grandma is fairy. Okay. Grand Crud. We can do Grand Crud. Oh my gosh, that's such a perfect name. Whoever just said that. <laughs> okay, hold on. We can do some symbols, guys. Because they gotta swab the poop deck. Um, wait, can we not do faces in this? There's no faces! What the crud? Uh, we'll just, we'll just leave it at poop deck. Poop, poop deck XD. Alright guys, we are done with the cave. So let's get back out of here. And we're gonna go heal up. We're gonna go get some cut. And I guess we can come back and start killing more people. Full team. We already got a full team, man. That's like Pokemon number 7 now. Oh, check ability. I kind of can't because they're inside the, the PC, but we can go back and uh, check it once we get to the Pokemon Center. Oh my gosh, the random encounters. Oh, Nidorina, right, because Nidorina, when they evolve, their uh, ability changes. Thunderstone on Pichu, yeah, I need to check if there's any Thunderstone compatibility as well. So let's go do both of those. Let's go to Bag, and let's check out... Where is my Thunderstone? There it is. Let's see if anyone can use the Thunderstone. It's no use! Oh well. And we also need to check the new ability for Nidorina here, aka Venus Doyce. Copies special ability. What does that even mean? I'm Tracy Sketchit. Take this! It takes the foe's ability. Ah, okay. Uh oh. It's the guy with the hair. Can't I just be evil and just keep his goods? Maybe I'm the bad guy. Is that a thing? Are there any criminals that steal from other criminals that aren't just like Robin Hood? I'm talking real life. Does that ever happen in real life? He needs his goods. I'm the bad guy. I'm not I'm not trying to quote any songs here, guys. Pirates do that? Really? If you guys could join one evil Pokémon team, which would you choose? I mean, me I would probably go with Team Flare just because they have bright colors and I'm happy about that. Team Skull, gosh dang. We obtained the letter! But which letter is it? Oh gosh, I really hope it's not a W. Oh, there we get the Pokemon app as well, okay. Gosh dang it, stop talking to me! I'm mashing B as fast as I can. Oh, he healed us up, dude. Well, I mean, we could still go back and check out Granville at the Pokemon Center, but... Or we could just leave it a mystery. We could just go check out Granville if someone on our team dies and we have to replace them. The small problem is that Granville is such a low level. If anyone on my team dies, Granville's going to be really hard to catch back up. Buy a Moonstone. Can we do that? President Stone? I wonder what Pokemon can evolve with that. Gosh dang it, I don't want to select your Pokenav. Gotta check the map. Is he making me call someone? He's making me call an old dude. This is just weird. There we go. We done? There we go. We did it, guys. So we're gonna go back to the Pokemon Center. Let's go check out Granbull. <laughs> he got my number. Okay, let's go to... Yeah, someone's PC. 
And we'll just do withdraw. Gosh dang it, we'll do deposit then, fine. Do I have to deposit? Can I just do move Pokemon? Is there any way I can look without having to... There we go, okay, yeah. So here's Poop Deck, guys. Prevents flinching, that's pretty good. And here's their moves as well. Sky Uppercut, Recycle, Boomerang, and Psy Wave. Dude, Boomerang and Sky Uppercut are the same as Venus Toy, so they have two of four, uh, two out of four moves the same. What is your favorite Gen 3 Pokemon? Ah, oh, jeez. Probably Mawile. It's a Poopymon. Okay, I don't know why I just healed, considering they already healed us up, but I'm not worried about that. Let's go look for the Cut House. Guys, if there was ever a sign in real life that said Mart, it would be so easy to, easy to vandalize, dude. Let's go in here? Wait, did I just see Brandon? No, Brendan. Buy balls? That is a good idea. I'm gonna avoid that guy. Do you like bananas? Dude, bananas are so top tier. Let's go, yeah, just regular old Pokeballs. We'll let's buy like 15 of them. Actually, we already have two, so let's buy 13 to bring us up to 15. It's in a house? Okay, we'll go check out a house here. But the thing that makes bananas so good, not only do they taste yummy and crud, but they're so cheap, dude. Bananas, where I live, are like 40 cents a pound. <laughs> Why the crud is this a thing? Alright, we got the cutter's house. I'm just gonna pretend he cuts hair. Maybe he cuts people out of his life, I don't know. Hidden machine! Alright, I have it set so every Pokemon can learn every HM. So no matter what I capture, we can always learn the HMs. We'll never get stuck without that. Oh, he's a gardener, gotcha. You're allergic to bananas? That that sucks, man. I I don't think I have any food allergies. None that I know about. Yo, Vice, thank you for the Twitch Prime sub, dude. That banana price is like a quarter of what they cost here? Oh, man. Yeah, bananas are by far the cheapest uh, fruit where I live. Okay, we'll give cut to Pichalupa. I can just imagine with our little our little bit of Pokemon lore, we teach Pichalupa a cut, and they just like start cutting down the the ship sails and like cutting all the ropes and crud and ruining everything. Banana ice cream that does not sound like something up my alley. I do like banana splits, but I don't know when it comes to the actual ice cream part of it. I'd rather just have vanilla, like put all kinds of cool toppings on it, but just keep it vanilla, you know. I'm that guy that crud. <laughs> I'm that guy that goes to a frozen yogurt place or like a soft surf ice cream place and just gets vanilla with rainbow sprinkles on it. I know it's like the most basic crud ever. Well, I guess the most basic crud would be getting just vanilla with nothing on it, but Coffee ice cream is amazing. Man, I am not a coffee guy, but the past couple of weeks I've been making uh, cold brew coffee, which apparently is very easy to make. I had no idea, but I've been making it. It's super easy to make, and I actually like it. It's actually good. But I normally don't drink coffee. I think the main reason, though, is not because I don't like coffee. It's more because I just don't really like hot drinks that much. Like, I never drink hot crud. Okay, we got Orbok, dude! The only problem with coffee is it is gosh dang expensive, man. Okay, we're gonna go for Thrash. Oh, one shot, nice. That is a lot of experience points. Level 14 on Egg Balls. Okay, next up is Ursaring. So we're gonna go back to... Did anyone else have a fighting attack? I think Windows XP does. I was gonna go to Venus Toys, but honestly, Venus Toys is already my highest level. So Windows XP coming in. I just realized this is Elite Four Scarlet. Read this comment. Crud, I did. I don't like hot coffee, but iced coffee is so good. I think that's kind of how I feel. Why does he also have karate chop? You crud. Yeah, iced. I love iced tea. Oh my goodness. Yeah, the cold brew coffee I've made is the first coffee I've ever enjoyed. Uh, I really don't like coffee very much. So that's kind of the problem is like... 
you have to really like coffee to actually drink coffee because not only is it not very good, but it's also very expensive. Okay, we got Omanite here. If we had a grass attack, that would be amazing. Oh, we do! We have Giga Drain! Okay, I trash talked Giga Drain before, but right here, it good. There we go. If you don't drink coffee, don't start. It is overpriced. It's not, I don't think overpriced is the right word. Expensive is the right word. I mean, it takes a lot of work to get the beans or whatever. Pelipper coming in. Dude, we got Shockwave. Yeah, I'm definitely on the side of drinking tea, because you can get, like... I've seen in stores, if you get, like, some cruddy brand, you can get 200 tea bags, or is it... A, no, it's 100. It's 100 tea bags for, like, $2. There we go. Oh, baby! Okay, let's grab this ball. Revival herb. It's not an actual revive, is it? Is that a real revive? Did the game just troll me? Revives a fainted Pokemon. Great! Thanks, game! <laughs> well, that is something I can never use. I'm gonna check out my team real quick and see if I can move someone else up front. I want to try to keep this team pretty balanced here. Oh, guys, you know what? Let's try to have Pichalupa actually do a battle. Oh, no! This is a double battle. Have you guys ever eaten a Chalupa before? Uh, what's the best kind of tea? I really like... Uh, Lady Grey. Cyclist Jasmine. Operator Antoinette. Krabby and Gyarados. Did I... Oh my gosh. I just moved my Pokemon with an electric attack out from the start. Great. Um. Alright, we're gonna swap. Let's go to... I guess we'll go right back to Egg Balls because they have the electric attack there. And let's go for... Gosh dang, we'll go for Petal Dance I guess. Oh jeez! Okay, Petal Dance, I don't know if it hits everything or if it just hits the opponents. Krabby uses Protect. The one thing I actually wanted to hit with Petal Dance, I can't now. Okay, they protected themselves. Gyarados is going to use Mega Kick. That didn't do that much. We're fine. Wait, what? Did Protect stop the Petal Dance entirely? I'm going to try again, I guess. <laughs> do you like Watermelon just wondering? Yeah, dude, Watermelon's cool. I went to Clubby's parents for dinner uh, last weekend, and her mom made a salad. It was watermelon, feta cheese, and green onion. And it sounds ridiculous, but it was actually pretty good. Watermelon is too watery. Uh-oh. I don't think I've ever had watermelon with cheese before, before that, but yeah, it wasn't bad. We win. I slacked off in school, I could tell. Oh gosh, don't say notch. Dude, Clevy and I bought this weird fruit. It, it was so awkward because we, we brought this weird fruit up to the checkout counter at our grocery store. And the cashier was like, what is this? And we had no idea what it was, so we couldn't actually like find it in their system to pay for it. Because it didn't have a number on it. So we had to go back and figure out what the credit was. And then we figured out what it was, and I don't remember what it was now. Great. But it was some spiky orange thing, and you cut into it, and it's like got a bunch of green slime inside of it. And it was really gross. Free fruit. It wasn't free. No, it was not dragon fruit, but we've also tried dragon fruit before. Dragon fruit looks really cool, but it's always so disappointing. It was a lepa berry. Um... It was definitely not a durian. Let me see if I can find a picture of it. It wasn't it was not it wasn't very big. It was like the size of like a pear maybe. Uh spiky orange fruit. Yeah, that's the thing. Kiwano. Yeah, horned melon. A kiwano fruit. It's got like some green slimy seeds inside. It's pretty weird. Okay, I think we've battled all the trainers for this route, so let's go back. Oh my gosh. I don't know why, but my character randomly stopped running in front of that guy. I thought he was going to try to kill me. But we're going to go back, heal up one more time, and we're going to go and see Pico once again. Oh, what's your cat's name? My cat's name is Naru. It's a uh, reference to a uh, thing from World of Warcraft. Yo, if there's any subs in the chat, can you post some Sai Naru's? 
I'll buy a moonstone. Wait, but can we? I know I asked this before and then I completely forgot to check the answers, but can we actually buy a moonstone here? No. Gosh dang it. At what level does Windows XP evolve? Someone said 37, but I don't know for sure. Oh my gosh, that is a lot of Sinaros. Heck yeah, man. Do you like the anime called Shrek? That's the anime that ruined my life. Okay, you cannot buy a Moonstone. Oh, we'll move on then. Don't you talk to me! Why does he have to walk up from behind? Don't be weird, man. You had a match call? Oh, he's gonna ask for my number. You're just gonna walk up from behind me and ask for my number, dude. Okay, I'm gonna give you my number, apparently. <laughs> my number is 15. If we stop chatting, if everyone just stopped talking and chat, I would be so confused. Want to have a battle? All right, guys, I guess we're gonna do our second rival battle. Their starter, I think, was Venomoth. So let's see what else he has now. I think he's gonna have two or three Pokemon at this point, right? Here we go, Cyclist Lawrence. Okay, two Pokemon. Fero. All right, so he's got Fero and Venomoth. So Pichalupa going out. Oh, geez, I don't think Pichalupa can deal with this. Who could deal with this? We could go for Venus Toys to... No, let's go for Whiskash to Icy Wind. <laughs> the, the trumpets, all the dudes, man. Jump kick. Okay, I'm glad we did not go to any kind of normal type Pokemon. All the leftovers. It only heals 3 HP right now, but still, dude. Jump kick once again. Gonna go for that Icy Wind. Dude, this guy's level 13. I don't think we're gonna one-shot. Oh my gosh, not even a half, and now I have to loaf around, dude. My yeast is rising. I use uh, Visual Boy Advance. Oh, jeez. He's gonna keep going for Jump Kick. If he misses Jump Kick, does he hurt himself? Okay, there goes the leftovers. Oh, man, if he critical hits, I'm dead! Can I swap to someone better? Oh, uh, you know what, dude? Mrs. Donut Boy can take these jump kicks, no problem. Oh, that's only high jump kick that does that, okay. Return? How does he know? How did he know I was gonna swap, dude? Okay, we're gonna go for... I guess just Hydro Pump, right? Gosh dang it! I miss Hydro Pump all the time. Okay, he missed at least, thank goodness. Yes! Okay, so even regular jump kick... Well, he took like barely any damage, but he still took some. Where'd you get the ROM from? I can't find one that works. So, I can't legally send you to any kind of ROM, but guys, if you want to actually legally acquire a ROM, first off, let me kill this Metagross. We have Flamethrower on Windows XP, so we're going to go do flame th uh, Flamethrower. But the way to legally acquire a ROM is you have to get the, the game cartridge, and then you have to get some way to get the ROM off of your cartridge onto your computer. Um, there's a way to do that with Homebrew software using the Game Boy Player on the GameCube. So you can, uh... Oh my gosh, it did a lot of damage. Gosh dang, hopefully Flamethrower will kill this guy. Come on! No way! He did more than half, so I can't stay in here. Why the crud isn't Metagross? He was supposed to have Venomoth, I just realized! Um... Well... What do I do? Uh... <laughs> Venus Toys? Wait, what does Venus Toys have? Sky Uppercut? No, because he's part Psychic, so it'd be neutral. Uh, I think I'm still going to go to Venus Toys. I think they're just our best choice right now. Oh, I killed his Venomoth, you're right. But yeah, if you get an actual Game Boy cartridge, you can uh, get the ROM off there legally. If you download it from the internet, it's technically, technically illegal. There's like this common myth that if you own the cartridge, you can download it from the internet legally. That's not true, it's only legal if you get the ROM from your cartridge. There we go, dude. Okay, so uh, Metagrass is dead. Huh, we actually won. Level 17. Oh my gosh, level 15. Windows XP is the best level. Cyclist Lawrence going down. That was actually kind of scary. Dude, Metagross is pretty tough. Got him, dude. Okay, we're gonna go back and heal again, apparently. Dude, we've been in Rustboro City for so long. There we go. Will there be a Super 
Mario Maker 3? Oh my gosh. I hope so. What would you guys prefer? Would you prefer to have a Mario Maker 3 or to just have Mario Maker 2 get lots of DLC? So we got to do some backtracking, guys. I always found it kind of weird how they have you backtrack so much in this game. Oh, dude! We can grab these balls. We got ourselves a soda pop, dude! Guys, I'm just saying, I mean, I call them soda pops, but if I had to choose one, it's definitely soda. I'm sorry, guys. It's not pop. It's not Coke. It's either soda pops or it's soda. You can fight me. Okay, so we can cut down this. We're going to go and get some more hidden items over here. The trees have faces. What? I, th okay, this is a real question. Does anyone live in a region where you just call soda, in general, you just call it Coke? Because I was wondering this the other day. If you go to a, a restaurant and they say, what would you like to drink? And you say, I'll have a Coke. Do they just bring you a Coke or do they ask, or do they say, okay, which kind? Or do they say, is Pepsi fine? Okay, we got Arcanine. Let's run away here. <laughs> I ask for Coke, but it ain't soda. Gosh dang it, man. I'm gonna go down and grab these balls. What? Game? Are you being nice to me today? What is happening? Another leftovers? That is ridiculous. Who do we even give it to? We have it on Whiskash. Who, by the way, I need to level up Whiskash. Holy crud. Who, I guess... I feel like I should give it to my stronger members just to protect them. So maybe Venus Toys or Mrs. Donut Boy? Venus Toys is tanky. Dude, surprisingly, Egg Balls has a lot of HP as well. I think we should go Venus Toys. Hidden items, you're right. I always forget to look for those. I don't know where they are, man. Are there hidden items in this area? I'm kind of hitting... I'm hitting A as I run around. Hopefully we'll find them. There's a ball over there. Give me another Leftovers game. Another Leftovers. Vulpix. Vulpix's eyes are kind of creepy in this game. Can I do a British accent? Dude, I, I cannot do accents. I'm super bad at them. Oh my gosh, dude. It's going to be an amulet coin. Watch. Okay, it's an escape rope. It'll give me an option to get away once Brendan calls me and tries to go on a hot date. Okay, we'll jump the gap. Oh, the, oh, oh that's got to be a hidden item right there. Okay, we got a Carbos. So we could sell it for some money. Moonstone right now would be so good as well. Hey, lady. Oh, don't you run away from my love. She used her own escape rope. <laughs> You're a thief if you try to steal someone else's Pokemon. Guys, I'm feeling it. This right here is going to be a Moonstone. All right, we got it. I probably missed all kinds of hidden items, but I just want to go on a boat so bad. It's Pico, dude. Pico's trying to escape. Just imagine this, guys. He wanted to go with Team Aqua this whole time, so we actually ran away, and Mr. Briny brought him back. Now he's just trying to escape again. Poor Pico. I'll save you, buddy. Wait, did he just say pee pee? Pico. Okay, maybe you can't be on my team. That's way too vulgar. Hold on. <laughs> I'm Wahei3. Yeah, that's my name. My name has a number in it. All right, guys. We've got the letter. We're going to go to the boat. Is Mr. Briny an enemy captain? That is a good question, man. Well, it feels kind of weird going on, on someone else's boat. But I guess our, our boat broke down in a, in a shipwreck. So we have to save them by a new one. We're saving our allowance here. The phone call in the middle of the ocean? Can you imagine that, guys? If someone's on a boat and they get a phone call and it just, like, freezes the boat in place? That'd be kind of obnoxious. I think if a boat stopped that quickly, everyone would just fly out the front. Uh-oh, Dad Norman. Gosh dang it, Dad. Okay, we're just gonna... Try not to crash into any of these swimmers. Seems kind of dangerous. Oh my gosh, we almost got shipwrecked right there. We're fine. We got Duford Town, guys. Now, I'm pretty sure we could go directly to the gym, but I think there's a cave, a little area we can go to first. 
and uh, we have to deliver the letter. So I think we should probably do that before we go to the gym. One, to get some level ups, and two, just because, well, if we do the gym, this episode's gonna be really short, so <laughs> we gotta do a little bit more than that, right? Okay, I was like, why is that guy staring at that building? Guys, stop. Okay, there you go. Stop looking at the building. I'm gonna intercept. Wait. Guys, can't we get Shuckle? Ooh, Old Rod, you're right. Wait, is it from this guy? Give me a rod! I'm itching to fish. There we go, guys. We got the Old Town Rod. I'm kind of ashamed of myself for saying that. Gosh dang it. Okay, we get a new Pokemon. Yes. Hold on. Gotta find some hidden items, dude. Time to fish a level 5 Lugia. I'm really feeling it. Wait a second, guys. Route 107, Duford Town, different areas. We can capture two Pokemon. Okay. We're gonna go and set the uh, rod to our select button. Key item. Oh, it, it's such a key item. Here we go, guys. This is... Are we in Duford right now? Yes, so this is Duford Town. Here we go! Not even a nibble? Come on! Why does my fishing rod have one red pixel? It's like when you get a bad uh, Game Boy screen and there's a dead pixel on it. <laughs> my fishing rod has a dead pixel! Game? Do I have to, like, fish in a different spot? Oh, a bite! Here we go, guys! It got away? Wait, do I have to actually press a button? I'm so bad at fishing. There we go. Got it. I, I hooked it. We are hooked on pincer. All right, dude. That is pretty sick. It's only level five. Guys, do you think I can hit a level five pincer without killing it if I do cut? <laughs> pincer is the best water type. Okay, we're gonna try cut. I, I don't think it's gonna kill a Pichu. Oh my gosh, look at that. Volt Tackle, who do you think you are, Pikachu? He's only level five, that should not do that much. Yeah, two damage, we're fine. Oh, but he does recoil. Oh my gosh, he's gonna kill himself if we hit him again, isn't he? Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna just try to catch him here, guys. We can't hit him again. Oh, guys, Netball. I gotta take a drink of water. I got a frog in my throat again. water. Here we go, guys. The netball. I mean, you can hold down B if you want. You can wiggle some feet. I don't think we're gonna need to, though. The netball's so powerful. Come on. Yeah, I mean, was anyone surprised that we got it with the netball? That was so easy. This guy's 4 foot 11. Um, okay, guys. What do we name Pinsir? <clears throat> I need to drink more water, dude. I don't know why my frogs are so bad today. We can name him... Pickle? That's a good name. <laughs> name it Water. Let's see. We could do... Yeah, we could do Serpin. Kind of like a snake. Serpent? Mouth face. Name him Lardix? What? Netball best ball, dude, for sure. Sir Pickle. Sir Pickle. Will that fit? Like that, guys? Sir Pickle? <laughs> Old Town Rod. I'm not naming him Old Town Rod. Okay, let's put the space in a different spot. There we go, guys. Sir Pickle. Barnacle. Dude, Barnacle would have been a good name. I was playing uh, playing Diablo 2 with Brissy a while back, and I named my Route 106? Wait, can we catch something here as well? Oh my gosh, we're gonna catch so many Pokemon! But I was playing Diablo 2 with Brissy, and I named my assassin Barnacles. Check the ability. I'm gonna catch everything first because that pincer is gonna be inside the PC. So I'll catch everything first and then we'll go check all the abilities. <laughs> uh, do you and Brissy live together? No, we don't live in the same state. Here we go, guys. Route 107. 
gives us an actual water Pokemon, and it's level 9, not bad. I think I can very safely cut this guy. You know what, I, I can even go for Mega Kick. There's no way he's gonna die. See, look at that crud. Oh, they've got rough skin. A lot of stuff has rough skin. Flamethrower, that's gonna hurt. That actually might hurt a lot. Okay, we're gonna swap to uh, Whiskey Jack here. Here we go. Rough skin is really good. Yeah, it seems like it. Whoa, Flamethrower and Sacred Fire. This guy is definitely a fire type. Oh my gosh, we get burned. Well, hopefully the leftovers kind of counteract the burn there, but we're gonna have to go do some netball once again, I think, here. Let's go bag. Yeah, guys, it's a water type, right? Okay, hold on, hold on. I'm not an idiot, am I? This is not like an ice type, randomly. It's gonna be it's gonna be a water type, right? <laughs> it's Hono 2. Let's go for Okay, yeah, netball. Here we go. Holding down that B. This is gonna be so easy, dude. Get him, dude. Get him! And just like that, we've got ourselves a Clamperl. It's randomly flying type. Okay, guys. They're a bivalve. Oh my gosh. So, we've got Sacred Fire. We've got Flamethrower. I need you guys to post... Here's what you gotta do, guys. Take your two favorite fire Pokemon and merge their name together and put that in the chat. <laughs> Ooh, shiny. Do you have a water stone? I think I might. I'll have to check. <laughs> Clam. My two favorite water Pokemon. Clam. Architales, Infernon, Char Charo. That's pretty good. Charcanine. <laughs> Squirtle. Uh, oh my gosh, there's so many good choices. Man, how am I supposed to decide? We could do like Nine Tails with Ho-Oh and just name it like Nino. <laughs> Hounder. Oh, you know what, guys? We're gonna do ho -Oh with, uh, we're gonna do ho -Oh with nine tails. Can I do a hyphen? There we go, dude! ho -Oh and nine tails. And just so you guys know, t nine tails is spelled like that. I, I did not spell it wrong. Uh, ho -Oh is, uh, fire and flying. Alright guys, wait, 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 hold on, we gotta go catch one more, then we'll check all these abilities. How do I say crudart? Um, I have a, on Twitter, just uh, tweet it to me with hashtag crudart and I'll check it out soon. Well, I'll probably check it out after the, after the gym battle, if we get that far. Yeah, let's check if we have Waterstone. I don't think we do, but it's worth a, worth a check. Oh no, we have Thunderstone. I don't think we have any other stones right now. No, just thunder. But I kind of wonder... Oh my gosh, the rhymes. Uh, I was going to try to do more rhymes, but I'd just mess it up. It'd be a blunder. So I think what we could do, guys, is check the Thunderstone on like all of the different Pokemon we get. Because I'm not sure if um, it actually has to be a Pokemon normally compatible with Thunderstone. Or, like, say, say they're going to evolve into a Raichu. Would it be compatible with the Thunderstone then? Because normally you use Thunderstone to get to Raichu. So I don't know if it's the evolution that matters or the thing that it is doing the evolving. I don't know, man. I'm just going to go ahead and fish right here. Gosh dang it. We could fish next to Petalburg. I think Petalburg was still Route 104, so we couldn't uh, fish there. Okay, Pokemon number three, Route 106. Oh, oh. Hey, buddy. All right, dude. Yeah, let's get him with the cut. Oh my gosh. <laughs> There's a lake next to Petalburg Woods? Huh, I didn't know that. Okay, guys, Pokeball. Let's do it. Holding down B. I don't really want him that bad, but you know what? We'll, we'll catch him anyways. I'm not, I'm not gonna name him Peppa. Oh, there we go. 
Is Peppa like what you put on your, your meat before you eat it? Good ability. Oh, dang. Hmm, what do we name Swinub? Okay, let's do an anagram. I don't think we've done any anagrams so far this uh, stream. So guys, take Swinub's name, scramble up the letters. Oh, dude! Oh, dude! Check this out. Scramble up the letters. <laughs> Buns, dude. Buns you. Bun wins. Oh my gosh. That is so good. Yes, now that is what I call an anagram. Bun wins. Wait, is there... There's not two N's? You guys tricked me. There's only one N. I think Bunzi... Bunzi was correct. Bus win? Bunwiz. Guys, is this correct? No, we can't do Bunwiz. We could do... Oh, we could do Bunwiz like this. Bunwiz. I think this is correct. We're good. <laughs> Buns we. Okay, we're gonna go check all these abilities now, guys. There's so many Pokemon. Is there any way you can send me mail? Sadly, no. I, I haven't had a P.O. Box since I lived in California a few years ago. Okay, guys, move Pokemon. We got Sir Pickle, Hotels, and Bunwiz. Let's go check the summary here. Uh, we'll do the cave, guys. I think there's some trainers on the way, though. So first off, the ability is Limber Prevents Paralysis. Oh my gosh, Psycho Boost. I mean, Psycho Boost and Volt Tackle are both really good. I don't know about Sludge and Sleep Powder, though. But dang. He's a Limber Pickle. Okay, let's check out Hotels. Hurts to Touch. Yep. We've also got Karate Chop, Sacred Fire, Flamethrower, and Vine Whip. So we already knew they had Sacred Fire and Flamethrower, which are obviously some of the best fire moves in the game. So that's pretty cool. Sleep Powder for Catching. That's true. So far, man, we have not had a lot of trouble catching, but... I don't think we've had anything too crazy to catch yet, either. I guess Espeon's kind of crazy. Guys, look at this! Thunder, Solar Beam, Hyper Voice, and Rock Slide. Not bad. Got the 10 PP across the board. That's like 40 PPs right there. Sacred Fire, 50% chance to burn. The crazy thing is... Wait, never mind. I was gonna say I've never been burned by Sacred Fire this playthrough, but I think I just was by Clan Pearl. Volt Tackle has recoil, that's true. Is Volt Tackle basically like a double edge, but electric type? Uh, what was Swinub's ability? Uh, I forgot to check. I think it was that crud that does the thing. So check summary. And, oh, it's effect spore. So leave spores on contact. There you go. All right, let's get out of here, guys. So we're going to work our way towards the cave. I was thinking of going right towards the gym so we could make sure we get the gym done in this episode, but we still got like 45, actually 55 minutes, guys. So, no, wait. We've got an hour and two minutes. I just hit the recording. I'm not even one hour into this recording. So, yeah, we've got a lot of time to get to this gym. So let's go up to Route 106 and let's start killing people. We're going to go put up Whiskash into the front because they need some levels for sure. Whenever I do a Nuzlocke, I kind of like to have a core trio, like a three main Pokemon that I focus on, and then I have some backup as well. Oh my gosh, he's got a Latias. It's only level 11, but that's a little scary. What? Is Latias Dragon Psychic? I don't even know what I would use against this guy. I guess Icy Wind, right? Yeah, let's do Icy Wind. Vice Grip? That does not do that much, dude. Leftovers is going to heal almost all of that. If he has a Grass Attack, I am super dead. Okay, that doesn't do that much, but if he does, if, if he keeps doing low damage to me, we're going to be fine. Yeah, also cut their speed. Yeah! Loafing around. Extra Sensory. That's going to hurt a lot more. Okay, that still wasn't that bad. I guess Whiskash is really tanky, isn't they? <laughs> yes, isn't they? Let's go for Icy Wind again. You, you, yes! I was like, man, can we just get a critical right here? That would be great. We did! Almost 500 experience! So much for Whiskash being level 13. Take that, schoolboy Dudley. 
You think you can just win with a legendary? P sure. Dude, I have not gotten a single chance to catch a legendary so far this playthrough, but honestly, Mrs. Donut Boy is basically a legendary in my eyes. But I was saying before that battle, I kind of like to focus on a trio for the the team, and I feel like our core trio is Mrs. Donut Boy, Venus Toys, and uh, Whiskash or Whiskey Jack. I feel like Peachalupa and uh, Windows XP and, and who else is there? Eggballs. I feel like they're kind of backup. But who knows, Peachalupa, if they evolve, could be something really good. I just don't know if we're ever going to get them to evolve. Hidden item right above the cave. Alright, I'll check it out. Schoolboy Bob? Oh, that's a little scary. Wait, no it's not. Dude, we have extra sensory. I'm just a really sensitive guy. I don't know if that's what extra sensory means. Oh, dude, that was a lot of damage. Thrash? That might do a lot because he's a good attacker. No, dude, Whiskash is such a good tank. It's crazy. I'll check that rock for hidden items, dude. Why does that look shiny? A lot of these sprites look really weird in this game. Xbox, PS4, or PC? Dude, PC all the way. I'm... I'm on the, uh... team that thinks that combining PC with a Nintendo console is, like, the best... the best combo. For those who missed it, we have two leftovers. We just found them as random items on the field. I got two different leftovers. My cat's head is right next to the power button on my computer. It is kind of freaking me out. Okay, we got Ninkata coming out. Guys, what type is Ninkata? They're bug ground, right? Do I have any flying attacks? Did I have someone with Aeroblast or did they die? I think Windows XP had Aeroblast. Save the game. Okay, guys, after this fight, we're going to save the game. We just have to make it through this battle and I'll save the game. Don't worry, guys. <laughs> save the game so I don't get nervous. How do I miss? What is the chance of missing that? Hydro cannon? Okay, that did like nothing. Okay, arrow blast, one shot, no problem. Only 97 experience, not that great. Gosh dang it! He's got a Kyogre coming out. I could go to Whiskash and do Frenzy Plant, but Whiskash is not full HP right now. Oh, jeez. We could do Egg Balls and do Shockwave. Or we could do Pedal Dance on Venus Toys, but if we do Pedal Dance, we're locked in. Dude, this has been a tough route. Holy crud. We're going to try Egg Balls. We're going to do Shockwave. Because Venus Toys, I don't want to risk that. If we get locked into that Pedal Dance, it could be bad. Oh, it's so scary, but it's only level 10. Okay, Shockwave is going to do some humongous damage. Kyogre can't take Crud for damage. Okay, that did almost half. We're good. Icy Wind. That is not going to be that bad, I don't think. It's going to lower my speed. Only 12 damage. Only 12 damage, dude. We're good. And unless he has a different attack, I think we're fine. Oh, so close. Air Cutter. That didn't... Why is Kyogre doing such little damage? Slack off? No, he can heal! Oh my gosh. Okay, don't heal again. Let's go for Shockwave. Yes, we get to go first. Take that, you crud! Get destroyed, Kyogre. Groudon's better anyways, man. Sheer Cold incoming. I don't think Sheer Cold can hit because we're a higher level. 466 experience. Like in deep sea fishing, I lost. <laughs> he just recalls all of his failures. Fishing's great. Can we meet again? Can't I say no? I don't want your phone number, Bob. All these schoolboys trying to get my number. All right, guys. Got a cherry berry. I gotta look for all these hidden items. Let's find some random berry on the beach. I'm sure we're not gonna get sick by eating it. Dire hit? That's not that good. Guys, are there any more hidden items? Or is it just those two? Oh, save, 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 okay. Now, I gotta be really careful, guys, because on my emulator, the save game button and the load game button are right next to each other, so I have to be very careful. Okay, I'm, I'm targeting save. Okay, definitely targeting save. We did it, okay. We're good, we, we saved. 
There's an item right of shore, like right behind the sign? No, not there. Okay. Let's keep looking. I'm gonna just press A on like every spot. And hopefully we'll we'll get one here. There it is! Oh boy, dude! PP Max! There we go. Okay, we're gonna go up and we're gonna go heal. And I think it's time for the cave. We can go catch another Pokemon. And I'm hoping it's the return of Butt. But I'm not expecting it to be. Now Crudart. I think I'm gonna do Crudart after the the gym, guys. Okay. Wait, was this a new area? No, this is still just Route 106. Into the cave. We don't have Flash, but I think we get it like right here, don't we? Oh, dude, it's the Granite Cave. Yes. It's just so random. They're like, here, here's Flash. Like, if they're gonna give it to me right inside the cave where I need it, why not just have it not be a dark cave in the first place? Oh wait, we can't use it without the badge. I forgot about that, Crud. Okay, so that that I guess that's one reason. Here we go. Our brand new Pokemon is the ugliest Raticate I have ever seen. Guys, do we even bother catching this thing? Look at that, he doesn't even have arms. He just has hands coming out of his shoulders. You know what? If he is strong enough to survive my body slam, then I'll catch him. If you can take a body slam from a Whiskash, maybe you're good enough to be on my team. No! Get him out of here, man. I don't even want that crud anyways. So do we have to go deliver the letter? Ooh, balls. Yes! Mystic Water. We can use that to evolve Clam Pearl, right? No, wait. Mystic Water is a, a held item that increases water attacks. So I think that needs to go to Mrs. Donut Boy. Because they do have a Hydro Pump. All right, let's go ahead and give that. Boom. Oh, get the shuckle. Can we do that before the gym? Oh, gosh dang it. Well, let's see what we could have had. We could have had Raticate. When I played Pokemon Randomizer Nuzlocke, I got a Raikou on my first run. Holy crud. Make sure to drink water. I'll do my best. I'm gonna see if we can get that shuckle right now. I don't think we can. I'm pretty sure it was inside this house right here. Hey, buddy! Wow, you bothered? Yes. Everyone idolizes Brawly. I mean, he is a pretty cool Super Saiyan. Wait a second. They're gonna give me a piece of clothing? Thanks, guy. Wait, is Silk Scarf the one that increases your normal attack, or is that something else? Isn't Shuckle Gen 2? Oh, who am I thinking of? I could have swear they gave you a free Pokemon here. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking of the gosh dang... Oh my gosh, I'm thinking of Shuckle from Gen 2. Gosh dang it, man, I'm an idiot. So I think there's no free Pokemon here. I'm pretty sure we just go... Yeah, it's from Cien Wood and Gen 2. <laughs> Gosh dang it, you don't get a Pokemon here. In that case, let's go inside the cave! I guess we're gonna go explore this place and try to find Steven. Oh my gosh, dude. It's like the Super Mario Maker 2 effect where you can't see Crud. Already getting, getting into a battle. So here's what we could have had. Could have had him a choke. The buffest dude. Are the in-game trades randomized? Uh, yes, definitely. Pokemon marker. I can't see anything. Oh, dude, look at him. Look at him. He's double-handing that bone. Man, he's got a good grip right there. My favorite legendary Pokemon is Zapdos. Oh. Oh, yeah. We can... Oh, there we go. That was definitely not a waste of time, guys. Ooh. Gosh, why do I keep getting berries? I specifically went into my randomizer and banned... There's an option to ban bad items. So I banned bad items, which said it would ban berries in mail. But apparently, I'm still getting berries, dude. The berries want me to get them so bad that even when I ban them, they still appear. 
berries is not bad. I guess that's true. Oh, maybe it only banned bad berries. Guys, who is the worst Pokemon? Not not in terms of stats, but like who is your least favorite Pokemon of all time? Gosh. Why could we not catch that, dude? Actually, to be honest, if we caught Meatang, it probably would never have evolved because I think... Doesn't Meatang evolve at a very high level? Is this where I came from? I just backtracked! Gosh dang it. Okay, we're gonna do the hug the wall strategy. Pretend this is a maze. Oh, I love him! Look at his stupid face, dude! Which pixels are his eyes and which pixels are his nose? Guys, just visualize. Look at this Quagsire. Look at his face real close. Imagine the dots right above his mouth as his eyes, and imagine the ones farther up as his as his nose. It's so weird looking. So we got the mudslide right there. We can't go up that. Oh, dude, they're probably going to do something evil and put the ladder somewhere where I'm not going to see it. Oh, maybe over here? Oh, there it is. Making some progress. Making my way down the ladder. Okay, we're going to keep hugging the wall here. Here we've got... I wanted that! That is exactly what I wanted, dude! I wanted the return of butt. Gosh dang it. Why can we not catch this instead of the stupid Raticate? It's tiny butt, dude. Ah, man. That makes me sad. The butt claws. No, dude, we can't cheat. That's a rugged rock. Ooh, is there something here? Nope, no hidden items. Okay, let's go up the ladder, or stairs, whatever that is. Oh, this is dangerous. If we find a ledge, I gotta not jump it. Ah. Uh, my little vision hole is so tiny, I can't see anything. Oh, there's another staircase. Up there is a hidden item. Okay. Don't you come back. Don't you taunt me. They want to join my team so bad. Am I the only one that calls their eyes their ocular spheres? Who adds stairs to a cave? That's a good question. Okay, we got an X attack right here. Is that all that's up here? Gosh dang it. <laughs> yes, yes you are. Great. Maybe we'll get a shiny butt. That's true, dude. If we find it... Wow. If we find a shiny, then I can still catch it. We do have a shiny clause. If we find a shiny, we're allowed to catch it. Even if we've already caught something for the area. Oh my gosh, the encounter rate. Darn it, butt. There's so many butts here. Shiny, shiny butt just sounds too good. But guys, if we actually caught a butt, are we allowed to let it evolve or do we just have to keep it a butt forever? This encounter rate's insane. Gosh dang it, worm pull. We got worms and butts everywhere. Use the oh, we do have a repel, you're right. I have to repel the butts. Let's go to our bag. I think we have a super repel. Yeah, we do. There it is. Okay, we're going up. Did I just backtrack? I can't even tell, man. Did I just go the wrong way? Why am I doing this in the dark? Ooh. Let's go up here. Aha! Uh -huh, yo, yes! We got it. We can tell it works because the sun is working. How does the sun get into this part of the cave? Oh, there you are, Steven. My, my name is Steven. So we had to go inside this giant granite cave just to give this guy a letter. What am I, a mailman? I don't think a real mailman. Guys, if you tried to get a mailman to deliver a piece of mail inside a cave, they'd probably just say no. Why do I have to do this crud? So we got TM-47, but what is TM-47? Why am I just getting all of these dudes' phone numbers? Darn it, Steven. Get out of here, man. Okay, we're gonna go 
and I forgot about the random yelling thing from before. I forgot about that, Crud Man. Oh, Nightshade. That's not that good. Okay. You were supposed to get Silverwing. Huh. Oh, Steelwing. Right, right. Okay. Well, guys, with the cave done, what else can we even do aside from the gym? I think we just have to go do the gym now. I think it might be time. He's supposed to give you Steel Wing. Okay, yeah, we have the TMs randomized. We also have the TM compatibility randomized. So, yeah. I don't know who could learn that crud, but I don't know if we have any TMs good enough to really go out of our way to try to learn. The Spinning Circle of Doom? Oh, no! I mean, we could grind, but guys, look at this crud. Venus Toys already level 17. Our team is pretty strong, and keep in mind, we're gonna gain some amount of experience from the gym as well. Like, just before the even, uh, before the gym leader, we're gonna get some levels. Grind to level 100. Guys, we could grind, but forget about it. It's time to do some squats, man! Let's go! We're doing the gym! Oh my gosh, my vision hole is tiny again. But I think we can expand our hole if we uh, beat up some trainers here. So we're going to skip past the guy with the weird hair. And we're going to go left. Oh my gosh, we've reached a dead end. I can't believe this has happened. Let's try again. Oh no! Repel's effect wore off. Oh no, the butts are going to chase me again. Oh, we've got a split path. I'm going to go down... It worked! Don't you dare brush me off! Okay, how are you in the air like that? We've got Rich Kid Cristiano. I guess if you're rich, you can just fly. Sunflora, dude, we can deal with that! Mrs. Donut Boy can deal with this no problem. Of course, Windows XP could actually hit them with a fire attack, but you know what, dude? We're gonna hit them with the flinch. I know we're gonna get a flinch right in... Uh, see? I'm telling you. Let's get another flinch. Okay, forget the flinch, man. Critical hit. Just like that. 400 experience for that? What the crud? Brawly has a level 19? Uh-oh. Oh, boy. <laughs> that is... That's gonna be tough. The grinding has to happen. Um... Okay, guys. First, let, let's just fight all the regular trainers, and then we'll decide what we want to do, okay? We'll go from there. Uh... Oh! Oh! Dude, it's a double battle. We're going to expand our hole twice right now. We got the flying rich kid. Rich kid Jessica and... S wow, an actual sailor. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. No, Venus Toys is up. I was like, okay, if we got Whiskash, we could do Icy Wind. But uh, we don't have Icy Wind up here. So instead, we're gonna we're gonna do a lot of swapping here, guys. We're gonna go to. Does anyone else have a psychic attack aside from Whiskash? Because Whiskash is already gonna be busy doing icy wind. You know what? We're gonna hydro pump on that hairy mama. So hydro pump the hairy mama, and we're gonna go to Whiskash, and we're gonna go do icy wind here. <laughs> Will the gym actually have a fighting type? Well, there's a hairy mama right there. Follow me. That's it. Okay, that's not going to be that big of a deal. Hydro Pump. Wait, does it hit both? I always forget which attacks hit both. I meant to hit Harry Mama with that. Whoops. Okay, so we're going to use the leftovers right away here. Oh, follow me redirects. Got it. Okay, so we'll go for Hydro Pump this time on Harry Mama. And we'll do the Icy Wind. So we get to go first. That should do big damage. Yes, big damage indeed. Luster Purge. What the crud is that? Ow. It didn't do that much. I expected more out of Dragonite. Okay, Icy Wind is going to demolish Dragonite. Four times super effective. No one is going to survive that. And a critical hit. Guys, do the math. So we got... Icy Wind is, I think, 55 power. Times four. Times two. So that's eight times damage, right? So 500 times eight. No, 55 times eight. We just did like 440 damage? I don't know, man. Math is hard. Okay, we're gonna go for Headbutt this time, and we'll also go for Extra Sensory. A 
169. Uh, dude, we got 169 three times. Oh, you. Easy peasy. It hits for four times damage, you donut. I thought it was eight times because we got a critical hit. Okay, our vision hole has expanded quite a lot. I can see everything, but I can't see this guy, so we're going to go beat him up. Look at this guy. What is he doing? It's like, look at my foot. Okay, Sailor Jessica, I'll look at your foot. Oh no, not Pichu. Well, it makes sense that he would have Pichu considering he's a sailor, but Pichu's kind of uh, not a very good person to have on your crew. He's doing mad squats. He's doing the one-legged squats, man. I think, I don't know why they're called this, but I think doing a squat with one leg is called a pistol squat. Is it, like, a pistol shrimp? Like, why is it called a pistol squat? I don't know, man. I can't do that, crud. I can barely do... I can barely do regular squats with my own body weight. Oh! Let's beat this guy up now. Oh, yeah, guys. Someone did the math um, on my last episode when someone... The, the Lapras didn't miss the Hydro Pump and I, I missed Razor Leaf twice. Someone said that... The chances of that particular scenario happening were 0.16%. Uproar. There we go. That's not a lot of damage. We're fine. Headbutt. Now, Zatu has Horn Drill, but remember, Horn Drill can only hit us if they're higher level than us. So, because they're only 13, don't even got to worry about it. There we go, dude. Oh. Dude, that is such a good move. But not such a good move for a special attacker. It still might be worth getting rid of Vice Grip because Vice Grip is terrible. But yeah. <laughs> Superpower would be so much better if it was on someone else. I think Superpower is... It's basically like a uh, double edge, but fighting type this time, right? Grr, vastly overpowered! Now my team... I mean, I guess my team's a little overpowered. I don't know about vastly. Uh, let's see. I'm going to swap someone else up front just in case. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go heal. I wanna get Whiskash some more experience, but I don't like to go into any battle without, like, at least almost full HP. They're down to, like, one, uh, two thirds. I think they need a heal. Yeah, the hole is almost completely expanded. I think once it, uh, is fully, fully expanded, it'll go to a rectangle, but for now it's gonna stay a circle. Oh, superpower is one of those things that reduces your stats. Got it. <laughs> Can we reach 1,000 viewers? Now, I didn't put up a video on Psychoplays letting people know this was live, so I'm pretty sure it's going to be quite a bit less than we had on Monday. <laughs> the Awoos! Um, did we fight them? Hold on, let me make sure I put Whiskash up front. No, we didn't. Swap them around. And we go! There's no need for Brawly to be involved. I'll crush you! She's going to turn me into some orange soda, some crush orange. Rich Kid Zoe with Whalmer. Dude, Whalmer has the same thing. Imagine Whalmer, but the opposite of Quagsire. So the dots on the top are his, are, are his eyes, and the dots at the bottom are his blowholes. Uh, let's go for, I guess, Frenzy Plant. Bruh, I'm drinking crush orange Dang. I have some orange soda uh, in the fridge, but it's just Sunkiss. It's not Crush. Ooh, guys, did we learn Aurora Beam instead of Icy Wind? I mean, it's a little bit more power, but a little bit more power and accuracy, but it can lower attack instead of speed. I mean, I think we should do it. Let's do it. Can I have that orange soda? I guess, man. Dude, I'm drinking orange juice right now. Are we the same person? Man, I haven't had orange juice in a while. I'm not going to waste this loss. Okay, that vision hole is huge right now. Oh, there's Brawly! So we got to be careful about him wanting to go Super Saiyan. But guys, look at this crud. Look at our team. Level 17, two level 16s, two level 15s, and Peachalupa being useless. Come on, man. Sure, he's going to have a level 19, but 
We were only level 13s when we went to the battle with against the level 15. So the first gym had a two level advantage and we did fine. Well, technically it was one by the time we got there, but you know, still. I mean, I, I think we could win. We need 19. I think we're gonna be fine, guys. Because if we just overlevel for everything, it's not gonna be that exciting. We gotta keep things exciting. And also, I'm really lazy. <laughs> Famous last words. Yeah, dude, we've got the meat shield, we've got Pichalupa. Uh, he's like a beef Pichalupa, so we're good. We've got egg balls, we got Windows XP. They can all take some hits if they wanna protect our, our main crew here. Grind to 19. <sighs> okay, guys. Okay. I will raise three Pokemon by one level each. Which three Pokemon do, should I raise? Three Pokemon, one level each. That's it. No grind? No grind. Okay, you know what, guys? I'm seeing a lot of people saying no grind. No grind only squats. We're just going to go. We are just going to go, guys. Wish Scash is up front. Whiskey Jack, the captain, leading the crew right here. We're just going to go and do some squats right now. Here we go, dude. If I could find my way. There it is, man. Well, here it is, guys. There's our team. And it's time for the second gym leader, who apparently has three Pokemon in Pokemon Emerald, and his max level is 19. Wish me luck, because we are going to need it. It's too late, guys. Once you talk to him, you can't go back, so I, I'm locked in. I am locked in. Here we go, man. Entrepreneur Rachel, three Pokemon, starting off with a Mighty Anna, level 16 right here. Now, this guy would be weak to superpower, which we just learned over on Mrs. Donut Boy, or it could be weak to some fighting attacks over on, I think Egg Balls has a fighting attack. I think Windows XP has one as well. Who did we learn Sky Uppercut on? I think Venustoids. So we could even go for that. So we got a lot of choices right here. What do we have here on Whiskash? Nothing too crazy. It traced Truant? It really did? All right, dude, this is why you start with Whiskash, man. That's so good. Okay, guys, uh, don't swap. Okay, we could, let's just not swap. We're not gonna do extra sensory, that'll be immune. Let's just do body slam. Try attack. No status effect, please. Just none. That did, oh, oh, oh. We're still gonna get the body slam. Maybe he'll get paralyzed, come on. Ooh, critical hit? Yes! And you know what, guys? We also got the leftovers right here, so we're gonna heal 3 HP. Guys, if we use a Paralyzed Heal, will that waste the turn for Truant, or do we still have to... Do we still have to loaf around afterwards? Now we both loaf? That's true, we're gonna both loaf around. I think we might just... We could have a free swap, guys, that's true! Because he's gonna loaf around, we could swap for free. You still have to loaf? Okay. We're gonna get a free swap right here, guys. Let's go over to... Let me check my summary. Just double check. Uh, no, it's just Karate Chop. Hold on, hold on. Who had the good fighting attack? Not you. Okay, I think it was just Venus Toys that had it, right? Okay, so we've got Sky Uppercut. So I think we're gonna swap right here. Wait, what attack did they use on me? They used Try Attack. That's fine. Okay, we're gonna go over to Venus Toys here. Because they're going to be stuck loafing, so we basically get a free turn. Now, they might be faster than me. Wait! Did I just trace their Truant? Oh, no. Okay, well, we're gonna go for Sky Uppercut anyways. Psychic! No! No, 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 no! We're fine. We're fine. He's not a Psychic type. No same type attack bonus. Why am I loafing around now? What the crud? I didn't even get to attack him. Whatever, man, we're going to Mrs. Donut Boy. Just save us, dude. Just save us. How could he trace my Truant and then I traced his Truant? Okay, he's loafing. Okay, Hydro Pump. Superpower is probably better, but uh, Mrs. Donut Boy is just not a physical attacker. Okay, first Pokemon is down. There we go. Next up. Dude. Dude. It's a Sunkern. We get the freebie. Come on, Windows XP. Let's go hit him with that flamethrower. 
please be the level 19. If this is his level 19, we just win. That's just it, man. It's the, okay, this is not the 19. I mean, we could do flamethrower, we could do arrow blast. I don't think it really matters. Please have horn drill. No horn drill. They will just one shot. He can have horn drill if he wants. Windows XP is destroying this guy. Are you kidding me? His level 19. Why couldn't this be the Why couldn't this be the level 16? Why does it have to be the level 19? Gosh dang it, dude! Whiskash has Frenzy Plant, but he's paralyzed. Venus Doyce is low. Mrs. Dona Boy don't got crud against the water type. Egg Balls is Egg Balls, and Peachalupa is Peachalupa, dude. Okay, Egg Balls Shockwave? I think we're gonna go Egg Balls Shockwave, guys. We're gonna get him. L level 19 Kyogre, I'm not scared. <laughs> I'm not afraid of this guy. Okay. Do we go for Shockwave or do we go for Giga Drain? I think they're going to do the same damage, right? So all that matters is one's going to heal us. I'm slower, so go for Giga Drain. Wait, hold, hold on, hold on. Let me check this. Let me check the damage, guys. I want to be smart. I want to see if they have the same damage. I'm pretty sure they're both 60. 60 and 60. Okay, so Giga Drain just gives me a free heal. So I think we should just Giga Drain for sure. So let's go for Giga Drain. Metronome! Oh, that's so good! Self-destruct! No, don't self-destruct! Thunder? Is that gonna do a lot? Oh, no! The one-shot? He's not even a thunder type, dude. Electric type. Oh my gosh, dude! Why would he get that from Metronome? Ah, oh, man. What do we do? Guys, are we going to have to go for Frenzy Plant? I think that's our best choice. Peachalupa has Lightning Rod, but chances are his Metronome's not going to do that again. Whiskash is ground, so if he gets an electric t attack again, we're fine. But we're also paralyzed, which is really scary. Okay, Metronome. Bad. Bad move. Bad move. Leech Seed. That could... That could be bad. No, I can't move. Wait a second. Am I going to be stuck loafing around even though all that happened was I was paralyzed? I swear to crud if I'm loafing around. I'm going to be like so mad. Metronome. Bad move. Bad move. Whirlpool? That might do a lot actually. Okay, never mind. We're fine. I have to loaf. I can't believe I have to loaf off of that. That's so ridiculous. I should probably get this paralyze off of me. I'm gonna do one more attack, guys. And if we get through, if we survive this turn. Oh, it hurts so bad. Oh, I wanna heal. I really wanna heal. I can't switch because of the whirlpool. What do I do? Okay, guys, do I go for super potion first or do I go for paralyze heal first? If I do. Super Potion first. It's going to overheal a lot. I'm definitely going to heal, guys. This is too scary. Okay, we've got Super Potion. Okay, we're going to heal first, guys. We're going to do HP first. I know it's going to overheal a lot, but I just... I gotta. Goes for Metronome. Bad move! Just do, like, Growl or something. Swagger! Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. That's scary. Do I have anything that can heal confusion? If I can take advantage of that, that could be big. Do I have a full heal? That's a good question. I might have some kind of good berry. Let's check our bag here, guys. Uh, berries, berries. Heals paralyzed, awakens, poison, restores PP, HP. Pokeblock ingredient. Fantastic game. Just what I needed. I don't think I have any kind of full heal. Soda pop? No. Heal powder? Heal! Oh, oh, do we have heal powder? Yes! We can heal the confusion and the paralyze. That is so good. There we go. Get him out of here, man. Air cutter. That's not going to be that bad, right? That was a good chunk, but that wasn't that bad. If we can just one-shot him with Frenzy Plant, we're in a good spot. But I'm pretty sure we're going to have to survive two turns. And then we're going to be loafing. Oh, gosh, dude. This is so much damage. Do we risk it, guys? 
Use a physical attack? But what could we even do? Should I heal again? I know Frenzy is special, but what kind of physical attack could I possibly have? Venus Toys has Pedal Dance. I could heal again, but I, I don't have that many healing items, guys. I have Soda Pop, I have two Super Potions, and I have a few regular potions as well. I don't know if Kyogre had a healing move. Oh, Swagger raised my physical attack. I'm an idiot. Sorry, guys. I thought you were saying that Kyogre's a special wall. Um, I could body slam and then heal. You know what, guys? Let's use just a regular potion real quick. Because we have lots of those. Okay, bad. Bad move this time, please. No. We're going to sleep, guys. Taking a nap. It's okay. I can heal that pretty easily. But now we're going to get hit by the Leech Seed again. That's the problem is that Leech Seed, man. If you just didn't have Leech Seed, we'd be in a much better spot. And the Whirlpool, not to mention that. How long does Whirlpool last for, man? Okay, let's go for Berries. I think we... Actually, we have an Awakening. I know we have an Awakening. I'd rather use that before I use Berries. Okay, get him awake. Please, just get something bad for once. Come on. Yes, dude! He tried to heal, but he's already full. There we go. We got a freebie. It happened. Okay, so we got the Swagger, so we got we got a good physical attack right here. We're gonna go for the Body Slam. We're gonna get lucky, guys. I am feeling it. We are about to get... Uh, sorry. Uh, we're about to get the Paralyze. And because we got that Whirlpool off, we're not gonna take as much damage. He's gonna get something real bad right now. I know he is. There we go. Hyper Fang, not a big deal at all. Uh-oh. Okay, Body Slam. Watch this Paralyze, guys. Okay, we didn't get the Paralyze. That was still a good chunk of damage, though. I think it's time for Super Potion. Oh, he is a special wall. Okay. And Super Potion time. Definitely Super Potion time. Thank you, Potion Seller. You sold me three Super Potions. It's really coming in handy right now. Air Cutter. That's not that bad. Air Cutter's not that bad. Gosh dang, Leech Seed is the worst, though. I'm so glad we have leftovers. Honestly, guys, leftovers might be what saves this battle. Body slam. Come on, something useless. No! Wait, wait, wait! I'm a ground type! Oh, we got a freebie! We got a freebie. Critical! There it is, man! Okay. Wait, does he have a berry? Oh, you crud. You crud. He has a citrus berry. But you know what, dude? I got leftovers, so take that. Okay, the, the gym leader can probably heal this thing as well. Please, no grass, no grass. Morning sun. Is that another heal? Did he just heal again? This is the ultimate healing Kyogre. I cannot believe this. Oh, right, I'm loafing. I forgot. Uh, Frenzy Plant. I have Swagger on me, which increases my attack, so I'm doing more with that. Also, he's a special wall, so Frenzy Plant won't do as much. Oh, I'm gonna heal again. I know, guys. I know. But it's potion time. Frenzy Plant's not gonna do crud, guys. I could swap. I could swap over to um, Venus Toys and I could start doing some Pedal Dance. The only problem is that uh, Pedal Dance could confuse me. It could kill me because I'll be locked in. And not only that, but um, I have that Swagger on me increasing my attack, which I'll lose if I swap. Yeah, we really need to paralyze right now. I kind of feel like I need to actually hit the guy. Guys, do I risk it? Do I risk hitting him and then use a super potion afterwards? I could switch because of Leech Seed, but the problem is it'll also get rid of my attack boost. Yeah, guys, I, I know it's going to work. We're going to get the paralyze right now. He's going to do nothing to me. I'm going to get a paralyze. What? <laughs> we get a freebie! Yes! I'm still loafing. Wait, do you have to loaf after using a potion? What? What just happened? Wait, you have to loaf after a potion? I did not know that. Ah. Here we go. Okay, air cutter. Doesn't do crud. No critical. No! Whiskey Jack! 
Gosh dang it, man! I don't even know who to use! The captain is down, the ship is sinking! The stupid leech seed, man! Windows XP has a bunch of fire crud. Hit him with the firewall. Hold on. Windows XP. Does he have anything good? I guess Arrow Blast is decent. Guys, do we go have Windows XP do Arrow Blast? Is that our best choice? I mean, Venus Stoys we could heal, but the thing is, we can't heal them without it hurting someone else in the process. Ah, oh, jeez. Aeroblast is physical? That's definitely true. Remember he has Thunder? He Thunder was from Metronome. He doesn't actually have that. Uh Okay. Windows XP. Okay, let's go for Aeroblast. Okay, she's gonna go for air cutter. Please don't do a lot of damage. Oh my gosh, another critical. I think I do think air cutter has a high crit chance, but still, gosh dang it. That's it! That's all we did. He hasn't even used a potion yet. I actually have no idea what to do. All air moves have high crit, really? Man. Dude, Frenzy Plant would not have done crud. Save the X attacks. Ah, uh, man. I think we have to heal Venus Toys. I think we have to sacrifice Windows XP to heal Venus Toys, guys. Swap to Pichu and heal? Okay, guys, someone's calling it. Swap to Pichu, Lupa, and heal. So we're gonna do it. I'm listening to you guys. This won't do anything to Pichu, Lupa, because they're, they're electric. See, look at that crud. Oh my gosh. Hold on, I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna try something, guys. I'm gonna stall him out. I'm gonna PP stall him. I'm gonna PP stall the air cutter. Air cutter only has like 10 PP, right? So I'm gonna I'm gonna PP stall him real quick. No critical. See, look at that. Wait, it has 25 PP. Okay, if it has 25 PP, we're not gonna be able to stall anything. Guys, I don't think we have any choice. I think we have to heal Venus Toys and we have to sacrifice Pichalupa. I think that's the only thing we can do. We're, we're not at a point where we have to like save Pokemon. We're at a point where we have to save the run. If we don't do this, the entire run is over. This is our only option. I'm sorry, Pichalupa. It was either Pichalupa or Windows XP. We chose Pichalupa. The baby is overboard. Half of the crew is dead. We're fighting a gosh dang Kraken right now, the sea monster. Alright, Venus Toys. He's almost full HP. Now keep in mind, guys. They got the natural cure. Gosh dang it. Oh no, I got their natural cure. Okay. Once I do this pedal dance, we are locked in for two to three turns, and then we're confused. So once we do this, the cards are just on the table. We just have to watch. Here we go. No critical. Yes. Okay, us critical. Us critical. Come on. That's... <sighs> I guess that's what happens when you fight a gosh dang legendary special tank. Okay, here's what's gonna happen. We're going to use Pedal Dance, and we're going to get out of it with the confusion right now. We're not going to get locked in for another turn. Then we can Super Potion. That's what's going to happen. Or we'll survive with 1 HP. We're going to survive with 1 HP, guys. Oh, there it is. Okay, boom. We're confused. That's fine. So now we're going to go to our bag. We're going to get our little heal healing items out. I'm not going to use that yet. We're going to save the uh, energy route. Let's go for Super Potion. And we're going to top this dude up. It's a little bit of an overheal, but if we take another hit, we might die. Icy Wind. That's going to lower my speed, but I think that might do less than Air Cutter did. Never mind, that did more than Air Cutter did. Gosh dang it. Okay, but it's still we still have more than half of our HP. So we could go for a different attack instead of Pedal Dance. We could go for Meteor Mash, which won't do crud. 
We could go for... Nothing will do Crod, basically. He still has a potion, that's true. We're gonna go use a regular potion here. Where is it? Do we have two more of these? We're gonna wait for him to do something stupid. Bone Meringue has stab. I guess that's true. Guys, is Bone Meringue better than Sky Uppercut in this situation? X attack Boomerang. Bone Meringue, we could. Keep in mind, guys, I'm confused. If we attack him... Oh, they're not ground type yet. You're right. Yeah, they're not ground type until they're Nidoqueen. Queen. Um... So, we could still do X attack. What other X items do we have? X accuracy. We have dire hit. Raises the critical hit ratio. Guys, we could raise our critical hit ratio. Yeah, we're running out of potions, guys. We have one regular potion. We have one energy root. We have one soda pop. Over here, we have some berries as well. If we go to our berries, we have six orin berries, which only heal 10 HP each. And that's pretty much it, dude. I'm thinking I might... What I might do, guys... That is exactly what I was thinking. Epic Snivy OP. I think we might do Dire Hit. Then we'll heal with a Soda Pop. And then we'll go for Petal Dance. That's the, that's the strat. I think that's our only chance at winning. We have to get a critical. We have to kill him before he uses that potion. So... That's our only choice. Dire hit, going in. No critical. No critical. Survive, survive. Okay, okay, boom. Boom, there it is. Now we're going to use the soda pop. Wait a second. Do we have anything to remove confusion? No. We don't. We can't remove this confusion, so we just have to deal with it. I think. Yeah, so we're gonna heal. Let's go and use the uh, soda pop. Soda pop time. Normal potion? Guys, we need full HP. We need full HP because we're gonna be locked into Petal Dance for two to three turns. We can't we can't be down any HP when we do this. We have to go full HP. I know it's overhealing, but we really gotta have full HP. Not Icy Wind! I wanted Air Cutter, dude! Oh my gosh. If he just icy wins again, we're... Wait a second. Okay, guys. Here's what's going to happen, okay? Okay, let's just... Let's just potion once. Uh, what do we do? Okay. So, if he goes for icy wind... We could survive with, like, 2 HP... And then hit him with a pedal dance, right? And if we get a critical pedal dance... Maybe. I don't think it'll kill, but maybe... I could use a regular potion, but we're not going to get back to full. We'll still be 3 HP down. So I think we have to get through the confusion. We have to get a critical hit. Okay. We just have to go for it. Air Cutter? No critical. No critical. Gosh dang it, dude! We didn't get the pedal dance! Okay. Mrs. Donut Girl... Or Mrs. Donut Boy can go for... Uh, superpower? I think the run is dead, guys. <laughs> Not like this. Okay. I think we can go for... Wait, are we faster? Guys, does does Kyogre have good speed? Can we just headbutt stall? I might be able to headbutt stall him, guys. We might be faster. Okay, let's go, Mrs. Donut Boy. Alright, here we go. Stall. No, he's faster. He's faster, guys. That might be it. That didn't do crud. Okay, we have to go for superpower. We have to we have to just kill him right here. Critical hit! Critical hit! Come on, Mrs. Donut Boy! Be the savior we need! No! Attack fell. Defense fell. He's gonna potion. He's going to potion. There's nothing we can do. That's it, man. The run's over. The run is officially dead. 
I, I, I genuinely think there's nothing we can do right now. I think it's just over. Gosh dang it, man. Swap to remove stat lower? I don't think it matters. Okay. You might be right. Guys, there's one more chance. Our chance is we're going to heal up Windows XP. We're going to go and use Confusion. We're going to get a Confuse on him, and he's going to defeat himself. We can still do this. Energy Root. Windows XP. Full HP. Okay, Mrs. Donut Boy is down. Windows XP. You've got this. Confusion. Air Cutter, no critical. Good. Confusion. Actually confuse him, come on! Gosh dang it. One more try, one more try. No critical, come on! We can do this! Get the confusion! Get the confusion! No! I think that's it. I think that's it. Hold on, do we have anything? Anything that can heal? We have one regular potion. I think that's it, man. I could use a Master Ball on him. Berries. 10 HP. Hmm. I don't know, maybe something crazy will happen. Let's use the potion. It did just barely, just barely more than half. Okay, we're gonna start stalling with Orin Berries. Maybe he'll, maybe I'm wrong about his PP. Maybe he's almost out. No critical. He's slowly withering me down. It's doing more than 10. Maybe he only has one PP left. One HP. This is it, guys. I don't think Air Cutter can miss. But if it can... Nope. It's official, guys. The dream is dead. The ship has sunk. And this sea voyage has come to a close. While Hay 3 is out of usable Pokemon, we have whited out. We didn't respect Pokemon Emerald. We thought we could do it without grinding. And we were wrong. <sighs> now, we do still have Pokemon as backups. We have a backup crew, but none of them are gym ready. Gosh dang it, let me go move Pokemon. <laughs> we do have Poop Deck. We have Sir Pickle. We have Hotails. And we have Bunwiz. I think here's the plan, guys. We're just about at the two hour mark, so we wrap it up here for today. We'll come back next time. We're going to get the new crew ready. We're not going to disrespect Pokemon Emerald anymore. We will take it seriously. And we will come back stronger than ever and ready to defeat Brawly. He can't catch us off guard anymore. We know what he has. So, I think that's it for today, guys. I hate to end it on a low note, but the run is not over. We do still have four Pokemon. So, that's it for today, guys. I'll see you next time. Take care. So, I guess that's it for the uh, highlight version. I'm going to keep this recording going. And, guys, we're going to do some gosh dang crud art. So, if you guys are watching this on YouTube, that's it for the video. If you don't want to see crud art, you know, you're, you're done here. But, uh... For anyone who's interested in crud art, let's go get to it, guys. So. <sighs> that's sad. Now, guys, we're going to have to release everything. I think we're going to save that for the next episode. I just don't have it in me right now to do all of that. So we're going we're gonna to release all these Pokemon next time. We'll have a proper bur burial at sea. They're going to go rest in Davy Jones' locker or whatever. So here's the plan, guys. I'm going to go open up some music. I'm going to show some crud art. But here's the challenge. I'm going to play some uh, game music from some random games. And you guys have to guess which game it's from. I'll, I'll keep it pretty easy to start. But as we progress, it's going to get a little bit more tricky and a little bit more tricky, okay? 
So we'll start off with something a little bit easy here. Uh, let me get things loaded up. Um, I think let's do this one. I just want to make sure it's not too loud. You guys are going to get this instantly, probably. Alright, so let's go and get some crud art popping, guys. I'm going to leave it on the game screen for now. I'm going to go to the latest. <sighs> Man, I really felt good about this team. I thought they were going to go the distance. I got way too confident. I guess overconfidence is a flimsy shield. So I'm going through the crud art here. Gonna scroll down and get to where we were last time. I think we ended off... Oh, that's pretty loud. I'm gonna turn this down a little bit. I think that's a little bit better. Hopefully it's not too loud. I don't like to have the music super loud or anything. Now there's so much crud art. There's so much crud art, oh my gosh! I don't know what the Crud Sonic is doing to that chili dog, but I'm just gonna not. I'm just gonna not, dude. Okay, okay. I'm looking at recognizable stuff here. Okay, I think this is where we ended last time. So let's start getting some Crud Art open here. I'm at the bottom of the list. We can start working our way up. Wait, no, I think I saw that actually. Oop. Let's go a little bit higher. There, there we go. I think this is where we're gonna start, guys. We're gonna start with some beautiful stuff. So let me go get this all open. And then we'll... Get... I'm not going to click on the chili dog one. I was talking about how the six Pokemon that we had there were the original team. And that's true. But the entire team is dead. You know what you could do? You know what would be some next level... Gosh dang, this is still so loud. Let me turn it down a little bit more. Some next level Nuzlocke strats is take a random Pokemon into the battle and just like do some scouting figure out what the opponent's going to have before you bring your main team the only problem is like they'll probably just die on the first pokemon and then you won't get to see what comes after but that could be one strat oh that song's over already gosh dang okay i'm gonna play some uh, let's do something a little bit tougher guys i want to see if anyone can get this i love this song but it's not the most popular game in the world. So, uh, let's see if anyone can get this one. Okay, I've almost got enough open to do our first batch of crud art here. Actually, you know what? I think this is probably pretty good. Let me just double check, make sure there's no secret peepees here. Looking good. All right, looking good. And I think we're good to get started, guys. So here's the first critter of the day. Look at this, guys. Windows XP with the karate chop. Pressing the B button right there. He's ready to slap the B button. Here we've got a B made out of Evolutions and also Piplup, and uh, I think that's Binette right there. <laughs> Man, they have every single Evolution plush. That's amazing. I, I have a Piplup plush. I don't know if I have that same one, though. And my suffering. It's, it's been ended. Can Joy return? I really hope so. I would love to have a new Blissey. Here we have... Uh, let's see. Do not USB. What does this mean? Oh, no Ethernet connection. This is an Ethernet adapter. No internet. Uh, this is Mrs. Mr. and Mrs. Donut Girl and Boy. Psycho 2019 colorized. It's Thor. We've got Hatsune Miku. Touching the bee, dude. Now that's some next level stuff. I think this is the first time we've ever had an anime figure touching the B button. Go Windows XP. Oh, uh, all of these arts are so sad now that we know what happened. Look at all these B buttons, dude. Oh my gosh. Windows XP. Kazooie. Crud. Oh, Whiskey Jack. Uh... I don't know what this is, but it's beautiful. This is some modern art right there. Okay, let's go get some more open, guys. Did anyone actually guess what the game is? I didn't have my chat open. So if anyone actually got it, that's awesome. 
Oh, can you guys not hear it? I can turn it up a bit. Is that better? Oh, sorry guys. I can I can't tell how loud or quiet it is. What's the current team? Well, everyone's dead. But um, the new team is going to be Granbull, Pinsir, um, Clam Pearl, and who else was it? I kind of regret killing that Raticate now. Raticate could have been good. Oh, looks like that song's over. Even though you guys probably didn't hear much of it because I had it so quiet. Sorry about that, guys. I thought it was loud. It's it's really loud in my ears, so I turned it down a lot. But I guess for you guys, it was uh, for the stream, it was really quiet. So I'm still opening some credit. Man, having all these songs go by makes it makes me realize how long it takes me just to open these pictures. <laughs> Sorry it takes so long, guys, but it's just how it is. Okay, I'm gonna open... Uh, let's see. I, I know what game. One of my... Actually, this is straight up my all-time favorite game soundtrack. Uh, let's do this song. Okay, taking a look at all these credit arts. Um, you know, let's do a small batch here. Guys. Here it is. Anime was a mistake. It's nothing but trash. I say that as a meme, but I actually do love anime. I'm, I'm learning Japanese. I watch anime without subtitles in Japanese, because I'm a nerd. What the crud? Hold on. I didn't want the lyrics version. Ah! Hold on. Hey, let's do this song instead. Same game. If you bring anime near me, I will break your Nico Nico kneecaps. Gosh dang. Um, did someone make me into a sprite? Is that what this is? Hold on, guys. Is that m is that me? Okay, I I think that's me. I can't tell for sure, but I think it is. Guys, just wait till the song gets hyped, dude. It's so good. Uh, pressing the B. I can't even tell what this says, but I'm sure he's pressing the B. He's pressing that one, too. PP Max, guys. Can we get some of these in chat? We need some of these, please. Mrs. Donut Boy. I'll throw a donut. Hold on. I'm going to check chat real quick just to make sure... Guys, is it loud enough? Can you hear it? I'm pretty sure you can hear it. I'm seeing it's it's hitting up around negative 30. I'm thinking that's a good spot. Per perfect volume? Good. Okay, okay. So if it's hitting negative 30, I think we're at a good spot for music. Yeah, dude, I love this song. When Psycho hasn't seen Endgame and didn't name his Espeon Espeon Me, so you only pressed B on your broken Joy-Con and made a bad meme in MS Paint. I still love you and your vids, so I hope that makes you feel better. Good luck on the Nuzlocke. Hashtag Crud Art. <laughs> All right. Thor has returned from the stadium. Oh man. Okay, that's that was a small batch. Let's go open some more here. I think I'll try to do like ten at a time, maybe. Unless I'm remembering this wrong, Mr. Donut Girl made it to the end of their of their playthrough, right? It's just, it's always Pokemon Emerald, guys. Emerald is, you know, I hope it doesn't seem like I'm hyping up Emerald to be really hard just to like clickbait or like hype up the series and oh, it's actually really easy. No, like no joke, Pokemon Emerald Nuzlocke's are really hard. There's a reason it's the only Nuzlocke I've ever actually never managed to finish. So this next team, guys, we are taking it serious. Like, I'm getting everyone to, like, level 18 at least. And that means that Friday's probably going to be, like, all grinding. But, you know, if that's what we got to do, that's what we got to do, you know? Okay, so it looks like we need a new song here. Um, ooh, guys. Uh... Oh, you know what I want to do? I, oh my gosh, I want to do this so bad. This is such a short song, though. So I'm going to have to change it in, like, a minute. But you know what, dude? 
Dude, it's not even a minute. It's like 30 seconds, but here we go. I always get so hyped when I hear this. Dude, it's the hypest crud ever. Okay, I'm just making sure all these pictures are good. Good, 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 looking good. Yeah, by the way, anyone who's sticking around as I take way too long opening pictures, thank you for sticking around. Alright guys, Peach and Lupa joined your crud team. And now they're joining Davy Jones Locker. Madoka Magica. I need to watch this anime. I haven't watched this one yet. The outcast. <laughs> oh no. Everyone's an outcast now. The best friend, the hero, secretly a traitor, dies first. Oh my gosh, spoilers. They are both queens, you dingus. Oh, crud. There they are, man. Wait, I think... Is this like an update to the uh, crud art from yesterday? Hyper Bream! <laughs> you get him, Peachalupa. There's Whiskey Jack. There they are, man. It's so good. If XP dies, you need to play the Windows XP shutting down sound effect. I think we're going to have to do that, guys. Oh, no. Windows has found an infected virus. Wahey 3. Wahey 3 is not dead yet, guys. We still have four Pokemon. We're good. The Whiskash. I know the music has stopped. We'll get some more. Oh, look at those colors, man. Are these the shiny palettes or are these just like a custom custom colors? I don't have purple... Copics? I don't know what that means. I'm guessing that's like a colored pencil. Guys, there's the crew. This was before. This was before that fateful night where they found the sea monster. But there they are, man. It's beautiful. I love this smiley face in the front of the ship. Alright, let me get some more music open. Um, what do I want to play? Okay, guys, you're going to know instantly which game this is from. But you got to tell me which particular song it is. Okay, let's go ahead and get some more stuff open here. I don't know why it's taking me so long to open things today, but... Oop. <laughs> the gentle sounds of someone pressing the B button in the background. I accidentally played a video there. Are we even to today yet? Is this still credit from yesterday? No, okay. We just got to stuff from today, guys. Yeah, after the credit, we will do a big raid. Oh, okay, so we went directly from 24 hours ago to 10 hours ago. Alright, let me double check all these. All the pictures. Looking good. Guys, look at Whiskey Jack's Heine. What the heck, crud? Oh my- oh, it's just a loaf of bread. That's not the Heine, guys. You know how the breads have the curves? That's all that is, man. Oh my gosh, dude. Wait, is that a different picture or is that the same one? They look really similar, but I think those are actually two different pictures. Got Mrs. Donut Boy. Looking so elegant, dude. Egg balls. Property of YH3. I think we might have seen this one before. This looks familiar, but it's still awesome. There it is, man. Whiskey Jack, Windows XP. There's Aya, Mrs. Donut Boy. Yeah. Here's the crew, Wahe the Third. I love how Wahe the Third's a ginger. There's the Fallen Companions. He's gonna have to, like, take all these and drag them over there. <laughs> Gosh dang it. I'll be rooting for you after I wake up, lol. Good luck. 1 p.m. EST to 8 EST. 3 a.m. Holy crud, man. That's a little bit early. Dude, if you were actually here for this, please go to sleep. Guys, if you're on Australia, you might need to consider a nap right now. There's Whiskey Jack loafing around. I think this is an updated version. <laughs> Whiskey Jack used whiskey bottle smash. Get him, dude. Actually, Tentacruel was loafing around as well. I feel like you guys were not able to hear this song at all. This one's really quiet. Yeah, let's get something really loud. Okay, we're going to get something nice and loud, guys. 
with that crud. Dude, you gotta be like a video game expert to know what this song is from. Yeah, dude. It's one of my favorite games in this series. I feel like after the song is over, I should just say what it is, but I feel like you guys probably are getting it in like the first two seconds anyways. Let me open up some more credit. Oh, guys, we're already to the two hour mark, so I think because I didn't plug this on YouTube this time, there's actually quite a bit less uh, crud art this time around, so we should be able to get through it a little bit more quickly. Oh, dude, someone snuck a PP in there. We're going to close that. Darn it, Bulldog. He says, show this on stream, I dare you. All right, dude. If he's going to dare me, I'll show it on screen, but... Let's make sure these are all good. Okay. Here's some more crud art, guys. Boom! Got all these B buttons ready. Two different DS's. Like, it's a, it's a merging of worlds. We got Xbox, we got Nintendo. Yeah, dude. I love this song. Top 10 anime deaths, Aya is in here. Is this an actual video? Gosh dang it, watch Mojo. Whiskash is loafing around. Oh, dude, it's Bread Cat. Look at the team, guys. There they are. It's beautiful. Oh my gosh. Can you tell he's my favorite? There's Venus Soyce, yeah. Oh, Pichalupa's missing. It's okay, Pichalupa was useless anyways. Like, guys, did Pichalupa defeat any Pokemon in this entire... their entire life? I don't think they did. Rapid Discord. I don't know what that is. Guys, they're pressing the B... Oh my gosh, it's kind of loud. They're pressing the B... Uh, unknown right there. That's amazing. No one. Absolutely no one. Psycho. Hello! I don't think I did a single hello screen during this stream except for that one. Guys, Cuckoo is here, pressing the B on his body, being ready. Guys, there it is. There's the PP. I really hope I don't get banned for showing this on my stream. Oh my gosh, this song's getting kind of spooky. I cannot believe this picture that I'm seeing. It's a little bit spooky. Guys, I really, really hate to do this, but I think I'm just going to do one more round of crud art because I am going to be busy tomorrow, so I have to actually edit the entire highlights video right after I end the stream, so I really need to get started, guys. So I'm going to do one more round of crud art. So uh, if you guys want to see more, definitely go to the hashtag crud art on Twitter and, uh, you know, go take a look, man. Because we're, we're still two hours ago, so it, it would take me probably another half an hour to show everything. I'm sorry, guys. I love doing it, but I, I really got to start editing. All right, guys, here's the last batch. Boom. We got Whiskey Jack, man. The captain of the ship. Always loafing around, though. Here we got a B button made out of nail clippers. I don't know why they have six pairs of nail clippers, but that's smart, dude. You lose one, you can still clip your nails, no problem. The song needs to calm down. Here we've got Y3 holding up Mrs. Donut Boy. There's Pichalupa back there on, on Whiskash. Look at this Pokemon Tower. Oh, look at that, dude. It's always it's always the evolutions I feel like get the most fan art, man. Mrs. Donut Boy here. Mr. Donut Girl got a lot. Weedle got a lot. Dude, if you go to um if you go to Google Images and you type Psycho Weedle, I'm pretty sure it shows a fan art of Leafeon wearing a Weedle costume. Previously on Nuzlocke, Roxanne, Entrepreneur of Death, Rip Butt, Rip Illuminati, Rip Aya. Oh, jeez, trying to horn drill my Mrs. Donut Boy. There's the team, man. Hyper Beam, Windows XP, Mrs. Donut Boy, <laughs> Bread, Venus Toys, and Egg Balls. Never stop making donuts. The whole crew ate so many donuts, but now they're going to miss them. Arg, It's a pirate bread. Here's more Whiskey Jack, dude. 
I hope that just because they died doesn't mean we'll never see fan art of these Pokemon again. I hope they keep popping up sometimes. Even if they have to have a little halo. Guys, guys. If you ever do any more crud art of any of this crew, can their halos be donuts? Can Mrs. Donut Boy give them some donut halos? <laughs> Alright guys, that's it for crud art. And that's going to be it for today's stream, everyone. We're going to go find someone to raid, and we're going to wrap it up. One more round. No, I, I gotta get going, man. I'm so sorry, guys. But let me go find... Hopefully, I can find someone doing a Nuzlocke. Let's see. I'm gonna look up... Probably the Pokemon Let's Go directory is probably our best choice. I'll do Pokemon Challenges. Dude, the nut <laughs> last year we raided Pokemon Challenges. Let's do it again. Let's just do it this year, too. Alright, there we go, guys. So, thank you so much for being here. And I will see you all again on Friday. Take care.